Things happening here. It is bike to work day today with events happening in both Providence and in Newport. And earlier this morning, Michaela Johnson headed out to the festivities in the capital city. That's where she's live this morning. Good morning, Michaela. We got some bikers behind you or near you right now. Good morning. Yes, we have bikers all around. I'm actually standing here with Mark Dietrich, who is the president of RI Bike. And riding in now is actually Mayor Angel Tavares, who rode from his house. That's right. He's riding in, participating in Bike to Work Day as well. Good morning, Mayor. Good morning. All right. So I, I want to start off with, with you, Mark. Tell us a little bit about this event and how people can get involved. Well, thank you. First of all, well, good morning, everybody. Uh, this is the Rhode Island Bike to Work Day. Actually, every day is Bike to Work Day. Uh, if you want to come down, we're down here until 9 a.m. If you want to hit, if you're down in the Newport area for the first time ever, we're having Bike to Work Day down in Newport. Actually, there are festivities going on all day down there. And if you, I want to challenge each and every one of you. If you happen to live less than two miles from your work, there's no reason you should you should not be riding your bicycle to work. It's a perfect distance to ride your bike to work every day. The challenge is thrown, and, and how important is safety when you're commuting to work? Oh, it's critical. Uh, it's not only you have to you have to be safe yourself. You are a vehicle on the roads legal. You have to follow all laws on the roads and just ride like a car. If you, if you drive, if you ride a bike like a car, you do what people expect you to do. It's pretty safe. All right. And speaking of being safe, Mayor, you rode in today. It's great that you were participating in this event. How important is it for you for the community to be involved? Oh, I think it's very important, and especially in a city like Providence, where you have a small city and you can get around the city pretty easily. Uh, and so I think people should take advantage of it. It's also uh, a lot less uh, costly than gas these days. So to be able to get around the city uh, and to, uh, to save some money as well, I think it's a, a good benefit, and it's also good exercise. Absolutely. Like you said, great exercise. It saves you money on gas. And how, what's being done to, to improve commuting to work? Well, one of the things that we're doing is, one, having days like this to let people know that take your bike to work. Second thing is we also are trying to improve our roads because it's very dangerous for our bikers. It's also dangerous, obviously, for our cars as well. So we need to do that. We're getting more dedicated bus uh, bike lines, uh, lanes as well. Uh, so we have some in some parts of the city, and I'd, li I'd like to see that happen more around the city. Uh, we have a great opportunity here in the city. We need to take advantage of it. Absolutely. Fabulous. Things are being done. People are biking to work, including Mayor Angel Tavares. So if you can get out here, please come on down. We're in downtown Providence. And hey, bike to work. Back over to you. All right, Michael, thanks. We're going to check back in with you in just a little while. Welcome back to the Road Show. Today is Bike to Work Day, the culmination of a week-long celebration with events happening in both Providence and in Newport. And earlier this morning, Michaela Johnson headed out to the festivities in Providence. That's where we're finding her now live with more on the event today. Michaela? That's right. This event, clearly there are more and more people showing up for this Bike to Work event today. And standing with me now is Matt Moritz, who's the secretary of RI Bike Coalition. Thank you so much for joining us. You're welcome. Glad all right, so for all of you bike riders out there, we have some options for you. There are so many bikes, and, and I think I want to start with this one. is really like the most interesting. Tell me a little bit about this bike. Uh, this is a melon folding bike. Um, fits a particular type of lifestyle. Uh, if you do a lot of commuting on trains, for instance, uh, folding bikes are allowed on Amtrak and MBTA trains. If you have a day job in Boston, for instance, great way to take a, a means of mobility with you on the road without mm -hmm. having to worry about folding it. It just folds down very quickly. That's right. And you can, we had to have a little before and after right here. This is this is the bike semi folded up. Right. You can, it can get even smaller. And you said it's what about 20 pounds? Uh, about 20 pounds for some of them. You can get lighter, but so most of them around 20. That's not that you can lug that around, throw it on the bus, like you said. All right, moving on to the next one. If you if you need to take a lot of stuff with you, this one's good for that, right? Yeah, this one's set up to uh, be used as a cargo bike or as a, this is what I use as my daily commuter bike, so it's got racks on the back and front. Mm -hmm. Can carry about. A lot of bags there. Uh, that's just two bags. I usually only use one just okay. to go to work, carry a few pieces of paper, a computer, that sort of thing. But it can handle up to four and strap things on the top. I can get about 50 pounds of gear on here. Makes me slower, but it's not about getting there fast. It's about being able to get there at a, a pleasant speed. Great. And, and a bike that's kind of going by now. Wait, don't leave us. Very cool. Dog in the back. Can, can you also bring people in the back of this one? Yeah, uh, this is actually a child trailer that's been hooked up to a bicycle. Um, or you can put gear or an animal. Uh, just whatever works for your lifestyle. Groceries, as Bill said. There you go. So, so many different options, you know, whether you're going to the market, whether you're going to work, whether you're bringing your kids with you, there really is a bike for everyone. So be sure to head on down, bring whatever bike you got, whether it's a unicycle, tricycle, bicycle, anything today, as long as you're riding to work. Back over to you.